Hi and welcome back. Today I am going to show you how to design AV Groove Pulley using SolidWorks 2022. By watching this tutorial, you will learn how to design a pulley by using SolidWorks. By watching this tutorial, you will learn the use of SolidWorks tools like the sketch, line, circle, fillet, smart dimensions, circular pattern, mirror, etc. You will also learn the use of feature tools like extrude and extrude cut. Hope you will stay connected with us and continue learning advanced part modeling by SolidWorks 2022. We will draw the half sketch first and mirror it about the center line. In this way, we can reduce our effort and save time. Then we will use revolve command to convert the sketch into 3D pulley. Then we will use one sketch to cut the holes and the key slot. Hope you will love the way we design the pulley by using SolidWorks 2022. So, let's get started. We'll go straight to SolidWorks. Going to go and select plain white from the apply scene option. Now select material from the material menu. Let's select carbon steel. You can choose whatever you like. Apply and close. We are going to sketch the section view of the pulley. Of course, I will draw the half portion of the section view, as I already described. Left click on the front plane and select sketch. Take midpoint line command and draw lines like me. Make sure this line is vertical. From the view menu, turn on the relations command. Draw another line, and also make sure that this line is horizontal. Now, select these lines and convert them for construction. Now we are going to draw this sectional view. Take line command and draw lines like me. We gonna use approximate length, later we will use absolute dimension. The approximate length will be 35 millimeters. It's about 12 millimeters. It's about 23 millimeters. It's about 75 millimeters. It's about 27 millimeters. The height is 25 millimeters. This one is 5 millimeters. The approximate vertical distance is 18 millimeters. About 5 millimeters. It's about 18 millimeters. About 5 millimeters. OK, done. Make it longer, perfect. Let's use smart dimensions. Here the width is 70 millimeters.
drug the kerchure left to the center line, you will have the provision to use full dimension. This feature of SolidWorks is very handy. Here internal hole diameter is 25 mm. So, this distance will be 25 mm. The outer circle diameter is 50 mm, and the inner circle diameter is 25 mm. So, the thickness of the wall will be 50 to 25 is equal to 25 divided by 2 is equal to 12.5 mm. The length of this arm is 70 to 26 equals 44 millimeters divided by 2 equals 22 millimeters. This length is 100 to 25 is equal 75 millimeters. This one is 25 millimeters. It's 5 millimeters. The groove depth is 18 millimeters. Control select these two lines and make them equal. The groove angle is 40 degrees. Control select and make them equal. Same here. Make the center line and the endpoint of the line coincident. The width is the pulley is 78 millimeters. We need to define these geometries. The length is 5 mm. The length will be half of this length. Perfect. The sketch is fully defined and ready for revolve.
we need to use fillet in some corners. The fillet radius is 4 mm. Select these corners. Also, select this corner. Perfect. Press OK to close the command. Let's clear the sketch. From the view, command turn off relations and dimensions. The sketch is fully defined. Let's use the mirror. Select these lines for the mirror. This one too. We will mirror about this axis. Press OK, perfect. Let's use revolve command from the feature menu. Revolve about this axis. Press OK. Nice. Let's make those four holes and the key slot. Select the right plane and select sketch. Draw a circle like this. Select for construction. The circle's diameter is 63 multiplied by 2 equals 126 millimeters. Draw a circle at the node point of the construction circle. The diameter of the circle is 36 millimeters. Use circular pattern command. Select this circle for patterning. The number of the pattern is 4 and the degree is 360. Drug the circle for locating the pattern center. Here it is. Control select the origin and the center and make them coincident. The sketch is fully defined. Now we will make the key slot. Take the center rectangle command and draw like this. The width is 6 mm. Make them horizontal. Perfect. The sketch is fully defined. Let's do extrude cut. Select midplane. Randomly select the cut depth, but make sure the cut is perfect.
Congratulations. This is the part which we were trying to build. Press the spacebar of the keyboard and choose the isometric view. If you like this tutorial, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Because your engagement encourages me to upload new tutorials. Please also let me know through comments if this SOLIDWORKS 2022 tutorial helps you. Thanks for your time.